What is up, boys? We are back. Today is the day we get to the top of this bitch. How this is gonna go? Oh boy. Whoa. Oh, dude, that was sick. Okay, now what? Oh, these things. I'm so glad they're there, bro. Right, let's get that stamina. Up we go. Man. Some of the climbing in this game is actually really cool. We climb up this. Oh, we can. Just got mash A. Okay, we'll do it again. I don't give a shit about that inhibitor, bro. What do I do now? Ah, I think I know. Just gotta keep... Oh my god. That actually worked. Nice one. Nice. Keep going. Where now, though? I'm confused, bro. I mean it when I say, like, I am stubborn. Like, I legit, like, I take this personally that I can't get up this thing. Um, I'm probably doing this the wrongest way, but you know what? I don't care. This is the way we're doing it. Despite what the other said, I really did have a good plan. Uh, a solid plan. We could really activate this transmitter. Yeah? How? The army used to control that tower. I'll get up there. I have a transmitter here that can tap into their oh, signal fuck. and take over their broadcast. It's got to be another so way up. All we have to do is activate the sector antenna. Okay. That's all corn all, bro, but how? Okay, can I climb this? Bro, I'm too low down. Yeah. Ow, my legs. I just broke my legs because of that. Um, yeah, what? I don't care about the inhibitor, lady. I don't care. I don't need it. Oh, I kind of do, but yeah. I'm jumping too late, I think. <laughs> Fucking bitch ass, man. Oh, my God. Let's try again. Daylight's burning up here, bro. Like, I need to do this. There was one fucking bit. Oh my god, I was about to eat someone's ass there, I ain't even lying. I, I was about to kick off. Anyway, moving on. <coughs> moving on. <laughs> okay, there's another ladder. I'm guessing this is the way. Look how high up we are, bro. Like, I'm shitting myself. Like, this is ridiculous. Okay. Now what? Uh, I think... Wait a minute. What? How the fuck? I'm sorry. What am I doing? Oh, 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 oh. Go, 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 go. Turn, 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 turn. Jump, 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 jump. We're there, baby. Let's go. I'm at the transmitter. What's next? Good. Good. Now throw the switch, and that's it. Oh, I'm going to get to choose. choice. When I turn on the transmitter, Matt will tell me about the GRE doctor. I need to know where my sister is. And what Waltz did to us. Sometimes our choices are bigger than ourselves. I might Sometimes go with the survivors. The things we do, they matter. I'm not going to try to convince you. You got the transmitter working. It's your call. I might go with the survivors. Nah, you know what? If Fuck them. What kind of music did you used to listen to? What? I'm wondering what kind of music you'd play on your radio station. Uh, don't tell me it'll just be you talking all the time. If so, I'm changing my mind. You motherfucker, I can't believe it. Thank you, Aiden. Thank you so, so much. You have no idea. Oh, good buddy. Any kind of music, anything you want. Oh, he's so happy. Aiden, something's gone wrong. We can't detect the transmitter signal. The people need this antenna more than you do. What? Aiden? What have you done? 
You'll hear soon enough. And let's hope Frank's still got it. Frank, you handed control of this antenna to that washed up drunk. Yes. I can't believe it. I'll take it back. I promise. Yeah, good luck climbing the building yourself. Maiden. And I thought we were becoming friends. Sorry, Jack. I made my choice. He was pissed off with that, wasn't he? Like, leave him alone, bro. Jack seems like a good dude. Good day, <laughs> Frank is back, <clears throat> and I've got some more exciting news for you. Blankets, food, and drinking water are being collected at the canteen. All those in need can report to Nicholas. See, this is good. Stay tuned, and I'll be back soon with another message of hope. See, it's helping the people out. Enjoy the music. I probably should have gave it to the peacekeepers, to be honest, but... You made it. Hey, Luan. Hey. Hey. It's good to see you too. Oh. <laughs> Don't ever fucking do that again. <laughs> hey, where did that come from? You owe me one. Okay. Like my sneakers nearly tore off trying to get to you. Oh I'm, shit. I'm sorry. Uh, sorry. I thought I'd be scraping your guts off the fucking pavement, and you're sorry? Luan, I don't believe it. You were actually worried. <laughs> Shut up! Like I said, you owe me. My sneakers are ruined. I can literally feel the concrete scraping my feet. We need to get me a new pair. Okay. Um. Well, they don't look that bad to me. You sure we don't have more important stuff to do? If it was their looks I was worried about, I would have trashed them ages ago. I risked a trickier route to get to your sorry ass faster, but the wind blew me into a broken banner. Fucking spikes were nastier than they looked. They were my last pair of intact shoes, Aiden, my soulmates in this dirty revenge-seeking business. Without them, I'm... So... Let's go. Let's go. You, you want to go shopping for new sneakers now? Is this some kind of joke or? Do I look like I'm joking? <laughs> the one. Uh, uh, you said. Uh, oh. oh shit! So we're going. The uh, one. It's not a sign of weakness to say you were worried. <laughs> Look, can you at least tell me where we're going? There aren't a lot of shoe stores open in the area, I bet. Yeah, probably not. I thought I was actually steering it then. I was kind of worried. Easy. Easy. <laughs> Pull off the edge there. Oh, There's good. a place. Some of my old stuff might still be there. I thought all your stuff was at the fisheye. But I guess that's not where we're going. Just shut up and follow me. Okay, okay. No need to be a dick about it, bruh. Okay. Oh, we got a level four machete real quick. Let's put that fucker on. Uh, hello, high tech as well. Okay, hello. Um, alrighty. So, where the fuck am I going? Oh, oh. So, is Frank happy I gave him control of the tower? I didn't have a chance to talk to him yet. I hope it was worth it. Because you lost your chance to find Mia? <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. Now, let's just get my sneakers oh, back. Oh, God. Back? Were they stolen? The one? If you knew where your things were, why haven't you got... Okay, my apologies. I didn't mean to, like, fast-forward it. I was just trying to land. Apartment 216. Go look for a large red box with gold trim. That's where I stored my shoes. Aren't you coming with me? You're why my shoes are ruined. You get me new ones. Go inside... Take the shoes and leave. And don't touch anything else. Got it? Deal. I'm fine. Chicken. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Enter apartment 216. I gotcha. There's definitely going to be some zombies down here, isn't there? Very fucking surprised if there isn't, bro. Jeez. 
216, here we go. That was easy enough. Nice. I'm inside. Don't touch anything. Just get those shoes. What's in here that's got you so spooked? Yeah, I wonder. Is there some zombies in here or something? Like what? What's going on? Cool. <laughs> Wonder if it works. Our mixtape. Hmm. <laughs> this is not like the little one I know. <sighs> okay. Yes. Okay. We know. There's a shoes. A guy's boots? Hmm. hmm. It's a cozy place. Is indeed it. Okay. Oh, is this still our apartment? Yeah, it is. Okay, yeah. So shut that. I forgot the stairs, bro. thought did you find them yet no i'm sorry I, I don't see a red box anywhere you dope you're not looking hard enough there's another room behind the plywood. oh that's pretty cool <clears throat> the hidden room eh oh the one <laughs> you look almost almost happy bro you're getting like that guy off that netflix series you're getting a bit cringy with it just no She's named Joe. Pretty cozy nest. Yeah, it is. Um, Why'd you ditch it for that den at the fisheye? Because that den is my home. I took all I needed with me. Except for the shoes, that is. Well, okay. <sighs> Fair enough, then. Oh. Taking that, baby. Level 5 bow. Hello. Oh, yeah. So, I think it's time we upgrade our stamina. Just because. Um, yeah. Okay, the muni booster and the shoes. Nice. Red box in here? No. Bro, where are these damn shoes at, man? a red box. Ah, here we go. Looks like they uh, spend a lot of time here. Yeah, if you know what I mean. Slamming. Playing hide the sausage. Here we go. There's the one. I found your shoes. Great. Now get the fuck out of there. Okay. Jeez. Oh, but it's quite the love nest with the wine and the view and the music. I mean... I'm starting to see a whole new Luan here. And you know what? I don't blame this guy, whoever he was, for liking her. Fuck you, Aiden. I, I didn't... Luan, wait. What? Hack on. Hack on? Oh, you bastard. Oh. Love alters not with his brief hours and weeks, but bears it out, even to the edge of doom. That's all good. Maybe that's why she's on the kill list. Shit, Luan. That's fucking awkward. That's mega awkward, bro. Okay. Back up then, I guess. Okay. I have a feeling she's not going to be here. She's going to take off after we mentioned all that shit. Yeah, she's gone. She gone. Luan, are you there? Come on. I, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. Just meet me on my rooftop. Bro, I'm here. Get there and wait for me. You can give me the shoes and then 
fuck off. Well, I figured you'd end up at the place you go when you're. Okay, right, real quick, real quick. We've got a parkour point. Uh, far jump, slide, yes, give me slide. Okay, uh, journal, real quick. We did get some new shoes. Ah, oh, they're the same though. That's annoying. Um, got a bow and arrow that's like level 5 or some shit, so I'm gonna put that on. Pissed Fuck off. Yeah. I was trying to fly over there. There's a lot of these air vents on the way, so hopefully we can just, you know, fly into one, then fly into another, then fly into another, etc. I'm hoping anyway, but I doubt it because it's me, so. Don't hold, your, uh, don't hold your breath, you know? Okay, let's try and do it though. It'd be kind of cool to do it. Appreciate it. Bro, how the fuck do I get up there? I need to make a beeline for this one. This is going to be close, too. Right. And somehow... Try and get to that one. I forgot about the stamina. Go, 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 go. I'm fucking glad I increased that shit. Well, these are renegades. How do I get up there, bro? There must be a way. Oh, dude. Um. Uh, mind me, sleepy heads. Just trying to get up. Okay, this was not the way. Actually, I forgot about our nifty little climbing tool. This might help us. Um. Yeah, this is a little bit awkward. How the fuck do we get up there, bro? <laughs> okay, we're up on this building. That fucking building ain't this fucking building, is it? Ah. Just got to climb this. Yes, baby. Let's go. That will do it. I'm on my way, my love. <laughs> okay. Let's go. Let's nice shit. Okay. Where is she? Okay, we'll just wait for it then, that's cool. We'll just sit here like a bitch and just chill, you know. All good. No problem. Okay. Here, I got your sneakers. You should also have this. I didn't realize you and Hakon had been together. Why do you think he's so high on my hit list? Yeah, that makes sense. Just because someone reads poetry doesn't mean they don't deserve to die. Did you guys break up because he abandoned Frank, or...? Did he abandon Frank because you broke up? There's really no point in analyzing that now, Aiden. Whatever happened, it was a mistake, okay? I should have never been so naive. That's why I didn't want you snooping around. For fuck's sake, you could have just respected that. Sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Forget we went there. Okay. Cool. Leave me alone. Um, the one, what's going on? You just don't give up, do you? Nope. <laughs> you should know that by now. You should know I fucking hate whimpering. Saying how you feel isn't whimpering. Fine. Stick around if you have to, but don't interrupt me. I'm busy. Getting drunk? No, you dork. Looking at the stars. 
Oh, okay. Cool. Hey, I can see the Big Dipper. Hmm, aren't you brilliant? Except that's not the Big Dipper. Oh, whoops. <laughs> it was worth a try, though. <laughs> you know any other constellations? Yeah. Frank taught me a lot about the night sky back in the day. We were building the fisheye, and I'd climb the scaffolding all the way up to the roof. Frank would come up to tell me it's too cold, too late, and whatnot. But he always ended up telling stories for hours and hours. And I love to listen. Well, The stars are so clear, it seemed close enough. You could grab them by the balls. <laughs> Frank's way of putting it. Nice, huh? What about you, Aiden? And what about me? Do pilgrims get their hearts broken? Yeah. Um. Uh, well, I... We tend to... Just forget it. Wow. The shy type. Looks like your constellation is... Sickness. See Sick whatness? <laughs> there. Look. The swan. When I stargaze, I always find the swan first. You're making all this up to impress me. Maybe. Maybe not. <clears throat> Are you impressed? <laughs> Pretty much. Um... Um, let's, uh, let's get some sleep. Aiden, if I see Hakon, I'm gonna kill him. Simple as that. Don't try to stop me. It's fine. But you know revenge doesn't make you feel better. This isn't for me. It's for Frank. I will avenge everyone who died that night. A lot of stars winked out forever. Hakon talks big. But when it came down to it, he bailed on his friends and they died. He showed his real face. Fucking coward. Um. You can't turn back the clock. True. But I can stop his fucking clock. And I fucking will. Now. Yeah. Good night, Aiden. She's so weird, bro. Like. Legit so weird, like. <laughs> it's a brand new day, a brand new world. This is your friend Frank broadcasting. Yes, that's right. Broadcasting from the fisheye. <laughs> from now on, I'll be bringing you all the good news from around Philidor. Helping transform this city back into the community it once was. Hey. The one? Luan, you there? Right, folks. Let's start this new chapter with some inspirational music for you. Aiden, you there? Come to the canteen. No gotcha. offense, Frank, but I really don't have any more time for you. Matt was gonna help me find my sister, but I gave the tower to you instead, and now I'm... I'm fucked. Calm down. Come to the fisheye, and we'll talk. I might have an idea. Gotcha. I want to help you, Aiden. Oh, fine. Be there soon. Let's go. Little combat skill point. What do we want? Stab follow up. Precise aim might be quite nice. Let's go with that. Drop up. Go into the fish eye. Let's go for this one. Night runners. Let's go. And then one more. Kind of stand afloat. Okay. This one's a little stretch, but we might be able to get there. I think we'll make it just. I oh, don't know. Yeah, we should be good. Okay. I'm going to go to this building. How far are we? We're not that far from the fish eye anyway, so. One. It's Aiden. Come in. Luan? Come on, Luan, answer me. You there? Ah, great. I fixed the transmitter and now you go radio silent. Where's the way? Leave her, bro. Just grab some of this shit so I can heal up later on. 
What the? What's going on? There we go. There's a little bug there. But we good, we good. Nice. Okay. A little bit of hardcore parkour right now. Nice. I hear there are secret tunnels in the metro. And one keep moving. Decent. I don't know if this is to the fish eye or not, but it's gonna make us a lot more vertical. Um yeah, there we go. Perfect, look, and let's just go sail over. Don't hit the tree. <laughs> there we go. Nice. That worked. Well enough, anyway. Alrighty. To the fish eye. To Frank, actually. This is Frank on Radio Free Villador. Your neighbor, your city, once more and forevermore. Signing off. Talk to me, Frank. <clears throat> Excuse me. Look, we started off on the wrong foot. I'd like to correct that mistake. Have a drink. Yeah? For me. Uh, Frank, I really don't have time for this. I, I have to find another way to find my... Just listen. Attention now. With those? Renegades, yes. But how did you... The TV station used to be controlled by the military. They did more than just broadcast from there. Thanks to you, we can now listen in on the enemy. It appears that Waltz is looking for the same database you're after. But the observatory is completely soaked with chemicals. <laughs> I have no idea how this GRE crap works. But Waltz sure seems to know. Maybe the observatory is not the only place to access the database. Is this conversation all you have? Uh, for now. But if we got close to their position and hacked into their frequency, we could collect more intel on Waltz's plans. Sounds good. How? The transmission you heard was intercepted near an old military antenna in the wharf, just south of Marsh End Lane. Yeah. If we activate that antenna, It'll boost the signal, and we'll be able to hear everything they say. Every syllable. Okay. And you'd know exactly what Waltz is up to. Sounds good. Let's do it. Right, anything else before I get going? Oh, one more thing. Look at that poster, Aiden. Nightrunners used to abide by that creed. Live by it. I used to think we were as torn apart as that piece of paper. But the creed still means something. And if you increase the range, I can contact the remnants of the old night runners. Some must still be alive. I see it now. This means a lot to you, doesn't it? Not just to me, to everyone here. But there's one piece missing. Do you know why I haven't thrown this poster away in all this time? Because of Luan. When I saw her for the first time, she was maybe, what, eight, nine years old. She was barely alive. She looked like she hadn't eaten in a year. And she was trying to help some kids get a crystal back from the thief. Uh -huh. The guy was threatening them with a knife. He was twice their size, stronger, and she jumped on him. Bit his hands so deep that his screams were heard as far away as old Villador. After that, she gave the crystal to one of the boys and left. Oh. She didn't get anything out of it. She didn't have to risk it. I looked at her and thought, this is all we have left. As humans, we can fight one another. Everybody just for themselves. Or, no matter what, we can stand up for each other. Yeah. Then I wrote Sounds down this good. credo. That little girl helped the Night Runners become who they were for years. And if we are to be reborn, we cannot do it without her. Okay. I'm on my way. Okay. I'm on my way. 
Then go get him. I'll be on the radio. You remind me of Luan before she became obsessed with that goddamn hit list of hers. <laughs> I'll get ears on the renegades for you. I'll find out what Waltz is up to. I promise. Okay. Alrighty, boys. For today's video, I'm going to end it here. Thank you for watching. If you have enjoyed it, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you for more. Good old dying light next Good time. Stop some guys. Day. Have an amazing day. See you all again in the next one.